Now at 4.30, a big decision still to be made on how three crew members on the International Space Station will be coming home. The trio, uh, their time aboard the ISS, scheduled to end in just a few months. NASA and the Russian Space Agency provided an update on that leak that damaged a capsule attached to the station. News 6's James Barvero has the latest. NASA astronauts Frank Rubio and Josh Cassida working on the International Space Station a day later than their spacewalk was originally planned. Wednesday, NASA says an approaching piece of rocket debris forced the ISS to maneuver. It was the second time in a week a spacewalk was postponed. Streaming particles. And NASA says space debris could also be to blame for striking Russia's Soyuz capsule, puncturing a hole on the spaceship less than a millimeter wide and leaking coolant fluid. A week later, NASA and Russia's space agency Roscosmos say they're still working to confirm the cause of the leak and determine if Soyuz is safe for its crew. Rubio and two cosmonauts are scheduled to end their mission in space in March. We don't have final decision. In a teleconference Thursday, managers say it's possible another Russian capsule could launch a couple weeks earlier than planned and without a crew to make room for Rubio and the cosmonauts. They're looking at late February to send up the next Soyuz vehicle. If it's decided that it's an uncrewed Soyuz, Roscosmos would plan to return the current Soyuz on orbit and collect the data so they can use that for uh, future evaluations of missions. Earlier this week, Russia said it would decide what to do by the end of the month. Whenever that decision comes down, we'll update you here on News 6 and ClickOrlando.com. On the Space Coast, I'm James Sparvero, getting results News 6.